And rain total so far this year on the low side. Officially, we picked up about a quarter of an inch of rain last month, and normally we would see about two to three inches each month through the dry season. So we're running a rainfall deficit. Lawns and gardens are starting to show it. Our temperature is on the cool side, and with that very dry wind coming down from the northwest, that really dries out the vegetation even more. So uh, you may notice uh, some of those lawns getting a little uh, brown the next few days because of just that very dry, low humidity and persistent wind that we're going to have around. Uh, look at the radar. Nothing on the radar. In fact, not even a cloud in the sky cooling off quickly into the 50s by 10, 11 o'clock tonight. The starry sky not expecting any cloud cover or any rainfall at all. Eventually ending up in the 40s to the mid 50s, a little warmer along the immediate coast. Very similar to the temperatures we saw last night. Last night, early this morning, it was 53 and we'll see 40s to low 50s across the Treasure Coast early tomorrow morning. And then around the lake, a little cooler, especially Okeechobee at 44. Uh, and you'll want that extra layer, uh, jacket, sweater. I uh, probably won't need it in the afternoon, though. We'll have a little less wind, and we'll also have a little warmer weather for Tuesday afternoon. A dry weather setting up. There's uh, 8.30 on Tuesday, 30 p.m. Looks good for Valentine's. Right into Wednesday morning, just, slight, just a slight shower chance. And our next big weather system, that would be this one right here on our doorstep by late in the week. Until then, high pressure in control that brings us sunshine and dry weather for most of the week. And this front eventually makes it in late Friday and early Saturday. Uh, the models are trending to keep it a little bit weaker as it comes in, but it should cool us off a little bit. And for Valentine's, if we're heading out tomorrow night, here's uh, kind of a close look at the forecast. Again, looking at dry weather and uh, a little warmer tomorrow night and a little less wind around too. Uh, the rain chances start a little bit of a pop on Friday ahead of that next front, but they stay low pretty much all week long. Bumpy for boaters. We get rid of the small craft advisory that was in effect today. Sees about two to four. Could be a little bit higher at times. A moderate chop for the inland waters. There is a rip current risk around, though. Be careful. 47 Treasure Coast, 54 in Palm Beach County for those overnight lows. Tomorrow up to 76. So that's three degrees warmer than today. Lots of sunshine. Great day to get outside. The humidity nice too. Up to 80 on Wednesday. 82 Thursday. Up to 86. And we're getting close to record highs on Friday. Our records are 87, 88. So we could tie a record and then we cool off again the upcoming weekend and it turns breezy.